What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Raven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so before we head on to the Pokemon League, there is a little something here that I want to do. I mean, we've been meaning to do this for quite some time, and that is to decorate our room because, you know, Mama bought us a few dolls here and there. So let's see what she bought us. Let's see. Decoration. The bed, the poster. Uh, what's there? The ornaments. So she only got us two dolls. I'm going to put the Charmander doll on my left side right here. And I'm going to go with the Clefairy doll onto the right side. And uh, as you can see, that's two decorations right there. Not that much. But eventually when you reach a certain number in money that you sent her, she will actually buy herself or buy you a big old Snorlax doll, which is pretty cool. Now, another thing that we've uh, changed up is I did put my relic onto the PC because... You know, it's at level 47, it's already Pokemon League ready, and might as well have everybody else trained to get up to level, like, some kind of level at level 40s. So I brought in Hydra number 2, and I did teach him Waterfall because it's probably the only Pokemon that, you know, I have that can learn Waterfall. So, uh, let's go ahead and do this. I'm actually going to switch it out right here. I'm going to switch it with Cinder because, why not? Let's go with Cinder. And uh, let's go Surf. Let's do this thing right here. Going to the Pokemon League and all that stuff. Here we are in Route 27. And, of course, we get attacked by a Pokemon. Because why not? Let's get attacked by a Pokemon. And, uh, wow, it's a Tentacruel. First time we've seen that. Right? Wrong? Right? I don't know. Really? Hmm. Okay. Moving on forward and... Uh, really? Come on. Come on. Don't be like that. Ah, okay, so we get attacked again by another Tentacruel. I don't want to battle you, homeboy. I really don't. Why won't you leave me alone? Is it the candy they have? I don't know. And once we do, this guy looks at us. He's like, hey, do you know what you just did? You've taken your first step into Kanto. Check your gear, your Poke Gear and see. Hmm. All right. Poke Gear, here's the map. And would you look at that? We are in Kanto. So if you guys don't know, this is the original area, the original uh, Pokemon world that we first started in. And believe it or not, we are still the champion of this region. So, hey guy, I know that I'm in Kanto. I am the champ here. So, let's go right here and uh, the Tojo Falls. The link between Kanto and Johto. And you will be needing a Pokemon that knows Waterfall. That is the reason why we brought in Hydra number two. And before we go up to the waterfall, there is a little something here that we need to grab, and that is the Moonstone. But we don't have enough room in our in our thingy, in our bag. Okay, so let's, uh, oh yeah. Should probably give that to, to Nessie right here, and it's already holding onto a Mystic Water. Hmm, okay, well we, let's switch it out to Never Melt Ice. Let's grab that, um, let's grab that Mystic Water right there. We give it to Hydra number two. And uh, let's see, Dragon Fang. Ah, you know what? Calcium. Calcium, let's give that to Hydra number two. This special is going to raise. Um, let's see, Repel. You know what? Let's use that for the time being. Because I think we have a bunch of re uh, max repels. And uh, let's throw away that. And I think we're good to go. Alrighty, okay, let's get that Moonstone. We got the Moonstone. Okay, now, time to surf and turf and, you know, explore the world of Kanto, like we didn't even explore it, so we're gonna use that waterfall right here, and, whoa, would you look at that, moves us up, and, uh, if you guys play Pokemon Soul Silver or Chris or Heart Gold, this area right here actually gets changed up into, uh, into the story, which is awesome, and it all has to do with Giovanni. And his illegitimate son or something. I don't even know. But here we go. It's rare to see anyone come here. Are you training on your own? Why, yes, I am. Bring it. Let's go. Bring it on. And here we have cool trainer Megan. And she's going to come out with her Bulbasaur. Okay, I see where this is going. Level 32 Bulbasaur right here. And it's a good thing I have my Cinder out. I knew I was gonna I was going to use him. All right. Fire Punch. Did the Fire Punch work? Fire Punch did work. Eat it. That's right. Eat it. And, uh, well, he's going to come out with a... Or she's going to come out with a Venusaur. I'm going to stay put right here with Cinder. Look at that. Just 
Look at that Venusaur. Shaking his booty. Fire punch yet again. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. And there goes another Pokemon. Now the Pokemon bites the dust. And, uh, okay, let's see. She's probably gonna have an Ivysaur, right? Yes, Ivysaur. All right. Bring it on, Ivysaur. You ain't got nothing on me. Look at that. Fire punch yet again. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah, there goes Ivysaur and, uh... Okay. All righty. So we're doing good. We're doing great. Yeah, look at that. And she's like, oh, you're really strong. Yes, I am. And, of course, we get a phone call from Wilton. He's like, ah, it's Wilton. You have a moment? <clears throat> I'm fishing on Route 44, but there's nothing biting today. Help me while we time away. Oh, battle, yada, yada, yada. Okay, so we're not going to battle you, homeboy, because I'm going to the Pokemon League. Going somewhere more important than that. And if you go here, talk to this lady. She's like, where are you off to? Where are you off to with Pokemon? Pokemon League? Are you, are your Pokemon loyal enough for you to win? Let me see. Ah, your Pokemon trusts you with you very much. It's nice to see a good trainer. Here, a gift for your journey. And we get the TM37, which is Sandstorm. That's pretty good. Probably like the first, uh, first, first of many, uh, uh what was it? Weather affecting moves, I think. Yeah, one of the first. You got Rain Dance and, and Sunny Day. Alright, let's move on forward right here. We're gonna surf. Let's go, Nessie. Move on forward, and uh, we're gonna. Oh well, yeah, we're gonna go right there. And uh, let's go ahead and switch it up right here. Let's go with Talks of Batman. One of the candidates to go to level 40 right here, and uh, here we have. You look pretty strong. Let me battle you. All right. Okay. Let's see how good you can do. Bring it on, homeboy. So we have another cool trainer. His name is Blake. And Blake wants to come out with his magneton, and wow, I chose Kareem correctly. Where? I, I did, I did. Wow. It's a steel type Pokemon. Double. Double bad. So let's go with Cinder. Cinder, let's do this. Make this happen. And uh, there's that screech attack. Hmm. Sharply falls. Let's go. Flame Wheel. Oh, yeah. You don't like that, right? No, you don't. Oh, yeah. Magneton's been defeated. Look at that. Talks to Batman. Everybody's growing experience points. Kid Thunder as well. And uh, Quagsire. Wow. I remember we had a Quagsire at some point. And who should we use? Okay. Teddy. Teddy. Let's go, Teddy. Let's do this, Teddy. Bring it on. Your Quagsire against my Quagsire. Now, initially, it was... I was going to bring back Lucky for this episode as well. Unfortunately, it can't learn uh, any kind of waterfall moves. It can't. kind of irritates me a little. It really does. I don't know. So that's why I went with Hydra number two. And, uh, alrighty. More experience points. And this guy's coming out with his Execute. So let's go back to Cinder. Let's make things happen right here. Oh, look at that. Execute's looking cute. Not deadly, but whatever. Cinder, let's go with Fire Punch. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's right. You don't like that, huh? Buh bye Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And look at that. Kid Thunder grows to level 40. Well, that's one of the few Pokemon that grows to level 40. He's like, yo! Okay, so since that happened, I might as well get this out of the way. Take that. And I should give it to somebody else. Who should I give it to, though? Alright, let's go. You know what? We have to give it to Teddy. We have to give it to Teddy, because it's, you know, it's still at level 37. Alright, let's make things happen right here. Good thing we have uh, a rappel on. And this guy might... Eh, you know what? Let's just keep it where we are. Talk to this guy. He's like, hmm, you're good, aren't you? Yes, I am. I'm really good. I'm, the, I'm awesome. So here we have cool trainer Brian, and he wants to come out with his Sand Slash. Did I use the right Pokemon? Eh, yeah, okay, kinda, I guess. Wing Attack. Yeah. And uh, that does an incredible amount of damage, but there's that Sand Attack. 
And uh, we gotta get away right here. Gotta hit him right, right where it hurts. He's coming out with his slash attack, so he's sand attack, sand slash! And... Nearly beats him, and there goes another sand attack. But the good thing is, we do have an attack that never misses, and that's swift. That's right. We're smart. Eat it. Look at that. That's right. You're not feeling good that you're losing, right? There we go. There we go. Getting points. We're getting money. And here's another Pokemon trainer. And he's like, don't say a thing. Let me guess what you're thinking. Hmm. I got it. You're on the Pokemon League Challenge. Probably is, yeah. No, I was kind of thinking, hey, you want to battle? Bring it on. So here we have Psychic Gilbert, and he's going to come out with his Starmie. Hmm. He's got a Starmie, okay. Alright, I gotta beat this Pokemon real quick before it beats me, so let's go with Bite Attack. Yes. It's weak to a Dark Attack, right? And it flinched, so this is good for us. Double good, double good. Super good. Bye bye Starmie. Alright, Toxic Batman, you're getting those experience points real quick, and... Look at that, Teddy's growing to level 38, so I'm doing a good job growing my Pokemon, and this guy's coming out with a Giraffe Rig, so I'm gonna keep it with, uh, Toxic Batman. I'm just kinda hoping that this, uh, Giraffe Rig doesn't hurt me with any kind of, uh, psychic attacks right here. And that one took a lot. And there's that Confusion attack that I've been dreading. Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez. Okay. Let's go with the Bite Attack again. There we go. There we go. Say goodbye. Bye bye. Alrighty. Okay. And we got one more Pokemon, and it's an Executor or an Execute. Okay, so this is double experience right here. Fly attack, so we won't get hurt by any kind of psychic type moves. Look at that. Confusion misses, and fly attack. Oh yeah. Bye bye, Execute. Bye bye. Alrighty. Oh, nearly grows. Well, that's a kick in the nuts right there. Okay, so you're too much. Yes, yes, sir, I am. And which goes you... Oh, okay, all right. Now, there are a few items right here that you can actually get. I think there's a rare candy and something else. But I think we need the Whirlpool attack to actually get by right here. So let's go ahead and check this out. Yes, we do. I wonder if we can just give one to... Or give Whirlpool to... Uh, to Hydra number two. Let's see. Whirlpool. Alright. Huh. Huh. You know what? I'm gonna give it to Nancy right here. I will delete it afterwards. I just, uh. Hmm. Screw it. I'm just gonna get rid of uh, Confused Ray right here. Alright. So. We got ourselves. Whirlpool, and we can actually get past here now since there's a few items right there that we can get. And, uh, okay. Here we go. And there's a Pokemon trainer. Okay. Alright, I didn't see that coming. Alright, let's just get, get it with TikToks and Batman. Now, before we grab an item, of course, Pokemon trainer, tweet, 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 tweet. Okay. Alright. Bring it on. That's right. And we got ourselves a bird keeper. His name is Jose. No way, Jose. Coming out with a farfetched, farfetched ta ta, and a fly attack. Let's see who has the better flying type Pokemon. Yeah, that's right. I do. That's right. Didn't see that coming, huh? Oh yeah. And uh, oh, nearly beats him in one hit. And there's that fury attack that we don't want to get hit. Oh god. Oh god. And uh, swift attack for the win. Bye bye. There we go. And finally, level 40 for Toxic Batman. Still doesn't know anything else. I was kind of hoping it would learn like Sludge Bomb or something. Should probably check Bulbapedia. So he's like Tweet. Now this guy knew Tweet before twi Twitter came out. And here is the TM22. It is Solar Beam, I believe. So let's move on forward. I think we got one more item to grab. Oh, jeez. Okay, so we have to go all the way around. All the way around. Yeah, all the way around. And uh, right here. Okay, and 
Oh geez, we really have to go all the way around. Wow, okay, so we messed up pretty big. Well, we didn't really mess up, but we're gonna have to go around to Tojo Falls again. Jeez. Okay, and uh, just for that rep the max repel, we're gonna need... Oh, we got re little repels. Let's go Go ahead and waste the repels first, because we don't need a lot of a lot of stuff on our, on our bag right here. So here we are, surfing away with Nessie. And we got ourselves a rare candy. Awesome. Okay. Alright. Let's see. We already got level 40. Hydra number 2. Doesn't don't really need Hydra number 2. Let's see. Okay. Okay. Alright. I think I... I think I know who I'm going to give that rare candy to. It's going to be a little bit later on in, into our episode right here. We're going to be uh, exploring just a little bit more. That's right, we're surfing with Nessie. We're gonna get back into the Tojo Falls right here. I wonder if we going going up uh, the waterfall actually takes away from our our uh, the number of steps that we take for a repel right here. And uh, we're moving on forward, going down this waterfall. We don't have 2D yet. And uh, oh wow, just ended right when we got there. Okay, so we got one more bag right here <clears throat> and we're moving kind of sounds like I'm congested a little maybe maybe not I don't know so we're back where we're starting beat you beat you and I believe oh there we go Rika or Rieka or whatever her name is so we're gonna switch it up we're gonna go with uh, Nessie right here so bring it you shouldn't underestimate the wild Pokemon in these pockets they are kind of strong. Yeah, they are kind of a little bit strong. So here we have here we have Kultrina Arena, and she is very blunt. She's very very blunt. <coughs> Excuse me. So we got Nessie, Nessie with the body slam, and oh god, that dreaded bubble beam that we don't like. Not very effective, but here we go, body slam. Oh yeah. And it paralyzes them. That's good. That's very, very good. That means you're going to win. So here we go again. Body slam yet again. Say goodbye to Starmie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Starmie's not looking good right now. Now the race between who's going to make it to level 40 is beyond, is right here. Because we got both Nessie and, you know, Teddy fighting for that. So here we go. Needle Queen. And I'm going to go with Surf. Yeah. Oh yeah, that surf attack is good. Come on, finish him! Finish her. We finished her. Oh yeah. Hmm, okay, alrighty. And, and she's coming out with another Starmie. I'm gonna stay tuned. I'm gonna stay right here. Two, let's go with another Body Slam. And that Bubble Beam, you know, it's just gonna be the death of us one of these days. Ugh. Here we go, Body Slam. Body same actually does work, and look at that! Same effect, same everything. Some good stuff. Some good stuff right there. So we go body slam yet again. Oh yeah, buh bye. I'm loving this one. I'm loving everything about this. And Arena, you've been defeated, girl. She's like, oh, you're too strong. Mm-hmm. Very strong. And of course, mom calls us, and she's like, hi, Draven. How are you? I found a useful shopping item. Sorry about it with your money, you'll find it in your PC, yada yada yada. Okay, that's cool. Now, I'm not going to talk to Rena right here because she will want your phone number and she will call you. And she will be a dick about it. Trust me, she is. She really needs friends. Now, I could su suggest other things, but, you know, this is a PG thing. And, uh, huh. Hmm. Okay, I don't know why I did that. Really don't know why I did that. So, let's go back right here. And, uh... Go ahead and switch up our Pokemon. Actually, you know what? Let's keep Nessie on, on, out, out in front. All right, bring it on. I'm feeling great today. I feel like I could boot even the Pokemon League champ. Hmm. Not if I have anything to say with it. So here we go. We're coming up against a Fisher. His name is Sky, and he's coming out with this Quillfish. Mm-hmm. All right, Quillfish. 
looking at me like that. I don't like the way you look at me like that. So I'm gonna body slam the crap out of you. That's right. Don't like that, right? Oh god. And uh, well, there's that minimize attack that we don't like. We definitely don't like a minimize attack. Oh, here we go, body slam yet again. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. And uh, coming out with another cool fish. I don't have a psychic type Pokemon because it's uh, in the PC. So let's go with Kid Thunder. Kid Thunder will do something. All right, Kid Thunder. This is your chance to be awesome. This is your chance to, you know, destroy everybody. Oh yeah. Say goodbye, Quillfish. Bye bye. She says bye bye, or he says, or I don't know. Is he he or she? I don't know. And coming out with the Sea King, I'm gonna stay with this Get Thunder person because you know he's doing a pretty good job, or she's doing a pretty good job. So Thunder Punch for the win. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Bye bye Sea King. Bye bye. Oh yeah, oh yeah. And would you look at that, Teddy's at level 37 and or 39, and he's learning Slash, or she's learning Slash. Who should I switch it out to? Hmm. You know what? I probably don't need that rollout attack anymore, so... Well, we'll see what happens. We do need that faint attack, though. It, it, it will never miss, and it's a dark-type move, and, you know, eventually we'll be, we will be needing it. And uh, we don't need to battle these guys anymore. We just ran out on that repel, so let's go ahead and uh, use another repel right here. All right. Nobody's gonna attack us, and there's another Pokemon trainer. And I know what you guys are thinking. You know, he's probably gonna stop right at the healing house. No, I'm actually gonna stop right at the entrance of the Pokemon League. So, you guys got a long episode to go right here. As you can see, it's long. It's very, very long. So, here we have Psychic Richard, and he's gonna come out with his Espeon. Oh, wow. Remember, we had an Espeon? His name is Relic. He's in the PC right now because, uh, you know, see, that Pokemon's at level 47, and yeah, that's a move we could have learned at level 36 if we were a little bit more informed. Thank you, Bulbapedia. And that was a very good attack right there, and there's that confusion attack. Ugh. Come on. We can beat you with another body slam. And uh, there goes that Espeon right there. And we're getting closer to level 39 right here. And uh, that's another victory for us. Bye bye, Richard. He's like, good battle. Good battle. Okay, alright. And uh, let's see. Maybe there's something else right here, right? Oh, crud. Nope. It's nothing. Yeah, that's the reason why. Okay. And let's go with our bike because I really, really, really want to get up here faster. And uh, don't need to battle those guys. Now, there is something right here that you guys should check out, and, uh, wow, okay. By the way, you can actually capture, uh, Dodrios, right, or Doduos right here, so feel free, feel free to capture Doduos at any time, guys. Me, I am not going to capture Doduo, I'm just going to run away, and this is the house right here that you should check out. Read this, and it says there's something written here. Read it. Mm-hmm. To my brothers and sisters, we take pride in serving Pokemon trainers. When trainers talk to you, give them as something useful. Love, Monica of Monday. Keep keep reading. Monday, Monica will be at level f or at Route 40. Tuesday, Tuscany will be at Route 29. Wednesday, Wesley will be at the Lake of Rage. Thursday, Arthur will be at level thir or at Route 36. Friday, Frieda will be at Route 32. Saturday, Santos will be at Blackthorn City. And Sunday, Sunny will be at Route 37. We will eventually get to them. I mean, we were at those towns right now, right? I think we were. Okay, so I do have Mech Repels. A lot of them. So we don't need them. Alright, time to get away from this whole place. There's a lot of Pokemon right here, and this is the Healing House. Talk to this lady, and she's like, your Pokemon look a little tired. Let's go ahead and rest for just a little bit. And they are well rested. All right. 
So here we are at the last portion of this whole thing, and I am gonna sneak right behind her. Grab this, we got ourselves an ice berry. Not bad. Okay. Let's battle this chick. Since you come this far, you must be good. I'm going to give this battle everything I got. Alrighty, bring it on. Bring it on, sister. So here we have Joyce, and she's coming out with her Pikachu. Hmm, okay. Alright, bring it on. Bring it on, Joyce. Let's go with that body slam attack. And oh god, that. Yeah, that double team. Gotta love the double team, right? And because of that, wow, missed. We totally missed. So here we go. Ice Beam. Yeah. Say bye bye, man, Pikachu. Say bye bye. Bye bye. Oh, yeah. And. Well, she's coming out with the Blastoise. I gotta switch it out right here. Let's go with Kid Thunder. Mm hmm. Kid Thunder. Yeah. Here we go. Thunder Punch. Yeah. Thunder Punch for the win. Say goodbye to Blastoise. Because Blastoise is not looking good at all. And, uh,. Right, more experience points for everybody. Everybody. And, uh, well, she doesn't like it that we lost or that we won. Alright, so we're in the last part of this whole adventure right here. And, uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep Nessie because I, you know, want to get a level 40. And this guy is like, by experiencing tough battles, you gain power. Okay. Whatever you say, Confucius, whatever you say. So here we have. Gavin and he wants to take on Draven with his victory bell. I think I have a victory bell myself, right? Yeah, I seem to I, I seem to have evolved my Pokemon too. And here we go with the nice beam. Oh yeah. Eat it! Victory Bell has been defeated. Bye bye. Oh yeah. And we're getting closer to level 39 right here. Let's go. Kingler wants to come out with his Kingler. Kid Thunder. Get Thunder will do this. Hmm, Kingler looks pretty badass right there. I've always wanted to use Kingler. Maybe I should try that sometime. Alright, let's go. Thunderbolt. Or no, Thunder Punch. That's right. Bye bye And more experience points for all of us. Look at that. And... Coming out with this Flareon. Okay. Nessie, let's do this. Let's get it, Nessie. Nessie's gonna do this. That's right, Nessie. Nessie is going to do this. The Surf Attack! Flareon, you're such a... You suck. You really do. And there goes Flareon. You've been defeated. And look at that. Level 39. Awesome. Awesome stuff right there. Teddy, you're close to level 49, I think. You're, I think you're closer to level 49, or level 40. Hold on, let me see. <clears throat> Teddy, Let's see what you got. Yep, you're closer, so... We're gonna do this. We are going to do this. We're gonna go with the red candy, and we're gonna give that to Nessie, because, of course, Nessie... <laughs> Nessie's pretty badass. And, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who should we use next? You know what? We should just start off with Hydra. Hydra number two. You know, for good old time's sake. That kind of stuff. And, uh, before we do anything, let's go right here and see. Let's just check this out. Nothing. Okay, so that just, you know, it just, you know, brought my hopes up just a little bit. And, uh, of course this tentacle is stronger than our Pokemon. Wow. All right. I'm, gonna, I'm just gonna go. I don't want to battle you. I really don't. Okay, so let's do this. Let's win. You can do this, Hydra number two. Prove everybody wrong. So here we have another guy. He's like making my final preparations for the Pokemon League. Okay. Alrighty. I'm making my preparations to kick your butt. So let's do this. Jake comes out and he's coming out with his Parasect. Pretty good Pokemon. Level 33, Hydra number 2. Look at that. Badass. Okay. 
We're gonna have to go with Dragon Rage. Just, you know, beat him every, like, automatic 40. Automatic 40 every single time. There's that automatic 40. There's that slash attack. Takes a nice chunk out of our... Wow, it took a huge chunk out of our stuff, and, uh... We're gonna have to go with thrash attack right here. Nearly beats him. And there is that spore attack that we don't like. Okay, so let's just switch it out. Cinder, let's do this. Be a man. Okay. And uh, that slash attack. That slash attack will not do much. Here we go. Fire punch. Another winner right there. That's right. How do you like that, huh? You don't like that. You really don't like that. And uh, Teddy's close to level 40. And this guy's coming in with his gold duck. So let's go with Kit Thunder. Kit Thunder will do the job right here, right? Kit Thunder's gonna be the Kit Thunder. Because Kit Thunder's Kit Thunder. Alrighty. Alrighty. Let's see what happens right here. Thunder Punch! For the win. And Golduck defeated. Oh yeah. <laughs> and hello level 40. So I got all my Pokemon at level 40. We're ready for the Pokemon League, but I will be training just a tad bit more once we go off screen. Now let's move on right here. And we do have one more trainer to take care of. And before we do that, let's go ahead and heal our let's go ahead and heal our uh, Hydra number two. Not a good start, but eh, it is what it is, you know. Sometimes you win some, sometimes you lose some. Alright. So that's it, right here. And uh, before we go to her, grab this. And we got ourselves a Max Elixir. Keep it going, keep it going, alrighty. Let's move on. Moving on forward, we got one more Pokemon Trainer. Bring it on, sister. Here we go. I lost to a, I lost to a trainer named Silver. He was really strong, but he was ab like he was as if he was absolutely had to do or had to win at any cost. I felt sorry for his Pokemon. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. That, oh, Silver. Oh, Silver. Whatever. So we have Beth. She's coming out with a rapid action. And for me, this is good because uh, Water type against. Water type or fire type, that's good. The only problem is, Rapid Edge is a little faster than my Hydra number two. Let's go with that waterfall. And there's that Fury attack. One, two, three. Of course. Two times. Waterfall attack. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Takes a nice chunk out of her HP. And we're going to finish her off. But there's that stomp attack. Definitely don't like that. I don't like that. Here we go, and uh, Rapidash has been defeated. Eat it! Victory for Hydra number two. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. He's like Pokemon are, war are po tools of war. Oh, that is true. Okay, so that is pretty much it, guys. Stay tuned. In the next episode, we will be going into the Victory Road right here. I think that's what it is. Route 26, Pokemon League Reception Gate. Yes, we will be going through this whole thing. And then after that, going on to get a take on the Pokemon Elite Four. So I'll see you guys in just a little bit. See you guys.